welcome to Lavanya's computer classes. In this video, I will uh, share uh, latest compiler design R18 January paper 2023. This is CSE Artificial Intelligence and Machine Learning batch. Just a few days back only this exam is uh, over. So, tomorrow one more exam is there. Compiler design 3 to CSE supplementary. For them, it is uh, anything is useful or some idea. That purpose I will keep this uh, video. Just check it once. This is the CSE AIML 3.1. Just few days back only this exam is over. Just see this questions. Part A. The part A is 25 marks questions. A bit is difference between compiler and an interpreter. 2 marks. And B bit is what is the structure of C compiler. 3 marks question. And C is what is parsing. 2 marks question. <coughs> D bit is... Differentiate between top down parsing and bottom up parsing, 3 marks question. E bit is what are the applications of syntax directed translation, 2 marks question. F bit is define type checking, 3 marks question. And G bit is what is target language, 2 marks question. H is uh, list out different addresses in the target code, 3 marks question. Next I bit is define flow graph, 2 marks. And J bit is what is meant by constant propagation, 3 marks question. So, all these questions for part A, 25 marks. Next part B, essay type questions. 2A is discuss the action taken by every phase of compiler on the following instruction of source program while compilation ID equal to ID plus ID into 60. So, this is a question paper for 6 marks question. And B bit is what do you understand by the terms tokens, patterns and lexemes. This is for 4 marks. So, totally 6 plus for 10 marks question or internal choice. 3A is what is what is a finite automata? Explain briefly about NFA and DFA. That is for 6 marks question. And B bit is write an algorithm to convert a given NFA into an equivalent DFA. 4 marks question. Either these are that internal choice questions. Next one is three question third <coughs> two a three b one fourth question is consider the following grammar and construct to predict to parsing table. Some expression they give expression transport to expression plus term, expression to term, term to term into factor, term to factor, factor to expression, and factor to id. This is the for six marks question. And B bit is what do you mean by left recursive grammar? Write an algorithm, uh, eliminate left recursion that is for 4 marks question or internal choice fifth question. Write down the algorithm for recursive decent parsing, explain RD parsers with example totally 10 marks question. Only one, one question direct question. Next 6A is compare syntax directed translation and syntax directed definition. 5 marks question and B is obtain the syntax directed definition for a simple basic calculator. 5 marks question or internal choice explain about annotated parse tree with example. B bit is compare S attribute definitions and L attributed definitions. This is for 5 plus 5 10 marks. 8th question elaborate the following A is garbage collection B is tree based collection 5 plus 5 marks. 9th A is R, <coughs> internal choice, 9A, write an algorithm for partitioning of three address instructions into a basic block, 5 marks. And B bit is explain the role of flow graph in basic blocks, 5 marks. 10A is last unit, 10A explain in detail about the instruction scheduling with an example. B bit is what are the principal sources of optimization. Give the classification of code optimization, 5 plus 5, 10 marks question. And the last question, 11th A is differentiate between machine dependent and machine independent optimization, 5 marks. And B bit is outline the basic terms of data flow analysis, that is for 5 marks questions. So, read all these questions. This is only for idea, just for idea. Check according to your syllabus. Check it if anything is there means we have some idea how the paper, how the question paper, questions are coming for compiler design. Read it well and write well for tomorrow's exam. All the best and do subscribe my channel. 
if it is a if you feel it is benefit to uh, any benefit for your workmates share it to your friends also thank you for watching my video thank you